Hey everybody. Hello everybody. Hey everybody. It's Brock. This is Brock. And we got a new episode with another episode of All About. Of All About. All About. What's up everybody? We got a brand new episode of All About. It's Brock here and we're going to talk about a really easy angelfish to take care of. And also it's really, really pretty. So to get things started off we are talking about the bicolor angelfish very active very good personality prices on them you'll spend about thirty dollars tank size you need about a 55 gallon which they can get bigger but for right now i mean most of his life you could have a 55 and he'd do just fine care level they are moderate which really the only reason why is because you need a lot more live rock in your tank and he need to be feeding him algae to keep his colors up. So it's just like a couple extra things that you need to do for him. Temper, he is semi-aggressive. He can be kind of territorial in a tank. But for the most part, he's, he's real cool with all your other fish. Reef comp, with caution, is a bunch of what the websites say. And I'm just like, ugh, I would not risk it. He is a big nipper on your zoas, on your little polyps, on little stony corals, your SPS, stuff like that. He is going to hammer it down. I've seen way too many people mis make the mistake and put it in their reef tank and it just demolish it. So if you want my opinion, don't put it in there. But go look around because other people have done it and it just works just fine. Which I'm saying this right now, don't do it. And I have a little white spot puffer in my tank that's filled with corals and he doesn't mess with any of it. So every fish is different. So keep your temperature 72 to 78. Keep your DKH 8 to 12. pH 8.1 to 8.4. And your salinity 1.020 to 1.025. Everything's normal. Max size they say he can get half a foot you know six inches that's pretty big for angel they normally all angelfish get big i've never seen a bicolor get that big maybe two to three maybe even i don't even know if i've seen one at four inches and i think they normally stay small because they are part of the drawer for pygmy angelfish so they stay small for most of their life colors is that real nice blue and yellow on their body the blues almost purple sometimes on them that we get in the store it's real cool diet they are omnivore like i said feed them that algae it keeps their color really really pretty and also be feeding them your normal frozen brown shrimp mice shrimp stuff like that compatibility you know just give me a comment down below he can go with other angels he can go with other tangs he can pretty much go with anything but if you're worried about not too sure, just leave a comment and I might can help you out. Origin, they are from Fiji. A bunch of fish are from Fiji. That's the place to go. But really, the only other side fact you need to know is having a bunch of rock in there because this guy's going to be running around the tank, biting the rocks constantly. He's just looking for food and looking for algae to hit. So if you got an algae problem, this is a really good fish to get. But that's it for the bicolor angelfish. He's a really basic angel to get if you're kind of worried go for this guy another easy ones are like the coral beauty or the flame angel those are really easy but that's it for this guy hope y'all have a good day make sure to like and subscribe and i'll see y'all next week y'all have a good one